Well, another defensive back coach has paid the price for the way things are in the secondary. So a lot of you guys say that we were ravaged with injuries, and I don't see it like that. C.J. Gardner-Johnson goes out. Emmanuel Mosley was already hurt before the season began, and it was up to Brad Holmes to put the roster, the places, the pieces in place. And when it comes to Aaron Glenn, he has to be able to change his scheme a lot. And if you listen to, I want to say it was Aiden Hutchinson and Brian Branch when they were on Radio Row, Last week during the Super Bowl, they talked about how Aaron Glenn likes to blitz a ton. So anyway, our opinion on AG is going to differ. That's how it is. But looks like the Detroit Lions made some coaching staff changes. Now we knew, we figured some of these were going to happen and now they have been made official. This is coming from Lions Wire. Jeff Risden says, a couple of the departures we already knew. Defensive line coach John Scott was replaced by Senior Bowl uh, during the Senior Bowl week by new defensive line coach and run game tor- coordinator Tyrell Williams or Terrell Williams. DB coach Brian Duker left for the Miami Dolphins last week. Says one more positional coach has also been let go. Cornerbacks coach Dre B- Bly no longer appears on the team's coaching roster like Scott Bly was brought in from the college ranks for the 2023 season his group didn't show a lot of progress his departure is not exactly a surprise and then it says down here defensive quality control coach Wayne Blair is also no longer with the team his contract expired and he was not renewed well when we saw the Cornerback coach come in when we heard, I think it was, oh, John Fox is also not there as well. Says two senior assistant coaches have been, have moved on. Former NFL head coach John Fox won't be back in 24 after one season as defensive assistant. Longtime NFL coach Jim Holster is also out after one year as senior offensive assistant in Detroit. So everybody talking about. Aaron Glenn can be replaced by John Fox. No, he cannot because John Fox is gone. But we talked about last week when we got the news that I think it was Terrell Williams that he was in, that he was probably going to replace Dre Bly. And again, that's two defensive back coaches in two years. Two defensive back coaches in two years. Our pass defense was 27th in the league. Our defensive. So the thing that I want to ask you, and and so Dre Bly and Arby Pleasant before him are the two guys that they had to work with what they were given, right? Because when you talk about injured players, you talk about C.J. Gardner-Johnson being in, injured. You talk about Brian Branch Lou, being out a game or two. You talk about Emmanuel Mosley barely taking the field, but yet Dre Bly is the one that got fired or got let go. So now you have Aubrey Pleasant in 2022 and Dre Bly in 2023. Well, that didn't last too long, did it? So here's my thing. When is it going to fall on Aaron Glenn? Unlike the rest of you, I've seen enough of him, but he's going to have a chance this year because Brad Holmes is going to get a defensive line and he's going to get a secondary, uh, some secondary players as well. Could he bring back CJ Gardner Johnson? The move from Tracy Walker could say that they're going to bring back C.J. Gardner-Johnson. Brian Branch is on a second-round rookie contract, so he's not, money-wise, he's not an issue. Are we going to bring somebody else, a Kendall Fuller, a LeJarius Sneed, a Jalen Johnson, somebody in that secondary? There's there's not going to be any excuses for Aaron Glenn this year. None whatsoever. A lot of people are going to show who they really are this year. Brad Holmes is going to show who he really is with the money and the draft capital. Dan Campbell is going to show who he really is If Aaron Glenn does not live up to par and Aaron Glenn will show us who he really is when we get a defensive line and we're not going to have we're going to have a secondary as well. So anyway, Lions moving on from Dre Bly, John Fox coming from Lions Wire and Jeff Risden. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Like I told you all, man, I need to put that on a soundboard. I came in here to talk Lions and chew bubblegum and I'm all out of bubblegum and I'm just. Uh, two defensive back coaches in two years. And you could argue 
that the secondary was better than it was in 2022 when we still had Amani Arari and Jeff Okuda. So anyway, like I say, man, I'm done. The excuses are going to stop for me and Aaron. They're, they're done for me and Aaron Glenn. They've been done. So anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Lions move on from a few coaches. The Dre Bly experiment is over, and I'm sure the abysmal secondary was his fault, right? So anyway, you guys are awesome. Take care of yourself and each other, and as always, go Lions.